you know, just all of me would be hurting. You! Time to die. Infernal Crush Cell! Maybe Infernal Cross Ed, even though Cross Ed isn't in this game. Spoilers, I know, but whatever. Smash Bang Attack! Ouch, I actually took damage for that. A Chain Attack? Oh boy. Hulk! You weren't behind it, so it's kind of not the best, but. Use you? No. No confusion. Naked lock! Oh my god! Not naked lock on a single target. Oh, he's dead now. I did it. Ooh, I got a glyph from it. Nice. That's tasty. Got the Egregious Plate. I don't know if that'll replace this M100. It won't. Sad. Hello. I'm going to ignore you. Leave it this. Like, this doesn't take us to where I thought it does. Now, this ramp takes us down there. Uh, where is this? Where are you? Oh, you're over there. Time for you to die as well. I would say I'm sorry, but I'm not. I'm not sorry. Oof, you got a spike on. Yuck. Gross. Gross. Maybe I should have Melee in the party. Considering she doesn't need a chance. You know what? Let's go beat up this dude first. You need a healing. We'll take this healing. Stand up. Ouch. And it's time for you. You're like pretty close to dying. No, I should probably do this. Uh, heal. That's not the same color. It's hard to tell. Shulk. Take this healing! I missed. I missed. This might be a badness. This might be a bad. Get up. Courage! Take my healing! Hmm. There we go. It's all fine. Yes, I did try hard, I promise. I worked so hard for you guys. 
I do my best all the time. Up here, I think there's just an item orb. Yum. But over here is something much more interesting. It is a button. You know me. I like pushing buttons. Especially big bread buttons. Those are the best kind of buttons. Power supply area one. I must push the button. Turn this uh, strawberry into green apple. And now this blinking strawberry is now solid green apple. Wonderful. Wow. It's also like a, um, it's like a, a bigger version of one of those giant, dangerous spinning cable things that we saw a while ago when we had to power a similar elevator. Well, actually not a similar elevator, but a different elevator. Skip travel? Not really. Then I guess I'll just walk there. Well, it shouldn't take too long. Especially not with Quick Step 25. So I'm sailing like a boat. Or a cruise ship, that's also a boat, technically. A vessel. Technically also a boat, depending on the context. Could be like a, a jar. That's technically a vessel. A cup, does a cup count as a vessel? Fourth floor, main power switch, push the button. Now you see, this one's at least a little more safe because you can't really touch it. So the door's green now! It was red before, but now it's green! That's how you know it's unlocked. Oh, whoops. Well. I slipped. Now I'm gonna probably die. Oh no! I died. At least now I know. Uh, I just remembered something. Uh, I think it's this spot. There's no. There is no fast travel there. That is very, very frustrating. I think I remember how to get down there. Go away, please. Thank you. No, leave me alone. I'm not interested in you. I'm more interested in ladders. Nothing beats a nice ladder. Uh, I could have sworn there was an action. No, I'm probably thinking of something else now that I think about it. There is a thing right down here. I think you can jump to it from here. I could be wrong, though. Sploosh. Spent fuel tank. This is important because there's a level 61 enemy. Cool. Oh, you completed your serenity. Nice. Uh.
This one. You got increases dungeon when taking damage. Nice. It's time for you to die. I missed that. I should probably change your art now that I think about it. Uh, you'll have earth and flare. Yes. Get this correctly. Thank you. Leave this fight to me. Display no mercy. Let's let's beat up these guys first. Pushing on the wrong buttons. Yeah. Wow. Melia got destroyed. You know what? Probably should take out these guys. Let's get wrecked. Me too, Fiora. I didn't get the heal off. Ooh, which means I'm gonna die. Yeah, I'm dead. Uh. I have perished. And of course, now you get the topple. Now I'm sad. And now I'm all the way back here. Oh well. I guess I'll just deal with him later. Uh, for now, let's go here. Back to the bridge again. Going from the outer is better. Yep. There you go. Oh man, look a surprise. There's a whole bunch of enemies here. Let's fight to the death. Let's fight. Friends beat up this one, yes. Burn! Burn fire! Okay, I guess that guy just kind of stopped caring about us. I missed. Your shot can heal. Confused! Now you're running around. That guy has rejoined the battle. Fiora. I was expecting a topple there. She was expecting a topple, I was. Confusion! Get smacked in the back. Here's poison. Here's gold. Nice. Silver chest. Silver chest. Taurus arms. And also another thing of slick oil. Sleek oil, excuse me. Uh, you could benefit from that actually. So can you. Hmm. Who gets it? Who gets it? Ooh. 
Give it to Melly. Give it to Melly. Who gets that? And then we'll change your uh, chest. Nope. Change your chest piece. There's something that's a little less weird. That looks really weird. Um. Well, this actually kind of matches everything else in color-wise only. I also got arms as well. I'm not better than these, though. You're not really. Door. The door opens for me. Push the button. High velocity lift. Push this button. I'm gonna go up super fast. So we should be going up super fast. This isn't very high velocity. I don't feel like I'm going very fast. There's moving bits on the screen. It's kind of pretty. This is blue raspberry color, I just realized. Looks like there's symbols. Kind of looks like unknown. Top floor! Uh, we're supposed to go this way to uh, this big giant circle thing. Oh man, it's a big giant super massive door. Or bulkhead, I guess. Wow. And a big giant field. First Zebrai bulkhead. Are you okay? She looks very tired. Should she not get some rest? Oh, thank you. But really, I'm okay. No. We'll find a safe place to rest. We've hardly stopped since we left the village. Ricky tired too? Ricky tummy rumble? I'm with you. <sighs> Time to park our... Get down! Whoa. A mech on assault. Can anyone see them? Another vision. Nice one, Shulk. No. It wasn't. Shulk? It wasn't a vision. Oh, hello. You did well to evade me. Just what you'd expect from he who wields the Monado. That voice... It's a faced method. Is there someone inside? What do we do, Shulk? We fight. But don't kill him. I thought you might say that. Oh boy. Jumps away. He is super far away, and we're super not far away. So this fight is very interesting. So when you step out behind, uh, from behind cover, he'll use linear laser f six, I think. It has infinite range, so you gotta hide from him, and then he can't shoot you. And your job is to beat up these mechon right here to so build up for a chain attack. Yeah, this is a very interesting boss. He's using linear laser. How do you solve this problem, you might say? Well, it's actually very simple. Change your tactics, come with me! And you can move behind the cover. So make sure you're behind cover when you're fighting uh, these other mechon. Otherwise, uh, Jade Face, I think his name is, will shoot you in the face and then you'll be sad. Chain attack chance time. I can't get behind you. 
because you're a jerk. There you go. I think you want to play with Monado. Man, linear laser again. I'm so scared. Just kidding, I'm not. Oh yeah, also because you're technically always in combat, uh, your health isn't going to regenerate, so to say. Ouch, what was that? Why can you see me? You're not gonna come over here, are you? No, you're not. You're a jerk. Ouch. Well, I guess I'm close enough to get hit by you. No, that's not what I wanted. Shulk needs a heal. Oh, I'm slowed. Ouch. Come here, actually. There you go. Heal! Fire! Freezing! Poison! Freezing again! More freezing! Freezing! Eventually, we should get close enough to this dude. Here, get healing. Oh, there. Just kind of standing there. You know, I feel like since you're supposed to be trying to kill me, you should, like, I don't know, maybe move? Instead of just kind of standing there watching. I don't know, I guess this is your preferred tactic or something, is to just kind of stand there and watch. Yoda's freeze. Yoda's stealing. Alright, now it's time to beat you up. Hello there, Mr. Level 60 Jade Face, you and your quick cannon. Confusion, okay. Crush Jaggy! And you only have to do a little bit of damage to him. Shola! Gatto! It's you, isn't it? Gatto. Please answer me! Let me see you! Oh, there it is, him. Oh. Gado. I knew you were alive. Gado. Is that Shala's boyfriend? Fiance. The destruction of the Monado. That is the will of Lord Egil. Gado? What do you mean, Lord? What's Egil done to you? What's wrong, Gado? Why would you say that? Speak to me, Gado. This world is in disarray. I must eliminate the cause of this disorder and restore the world to its original form. That is my duty. Nay, the will of the world. Now, the time has come. 
The time to restore order. Gado, stop! Oh no. Gado. Shala! Big explosion. Oh, well, I mean, I guess this will be a good cliffhanger, but... Episodes will be too short, then. Oh, hey, it's you. Lady Mayneth. It is not far off now. A world in which there is no need for fear. The hour draws near. Our will shall soon be done. First, there is the matter of the Monado. Our victory can only be assured if we destroy the Monado before it's too late. I sense your existence. I know you are alive. Zanza, the hour is upon us. Your time has come. Ooh, ominous. Shulk. Shulk. Who's calling my name? Shulk, you have acquired the ability to glimpse the future. The ability to understand the law of causality, as decided by a higher power. A higher power? What is the LSD like the Bionis. Why do you desire to change the future? Why do you wish to act against their will? I do just as anyone would do. It is natural to want to change an unhappy future. If that is their will, then I choose to fight. If that is what you wish, Shulk, then you must find your Monado. Monado? My Monado. Precisely. The one true Monado. True Monado? You can't do that. Because... You aren't here. Not anymore. <gasps> Man, this plot sure is interesting. Is, is everyone okay? Yeah. That was a close one. I mean, how on Bionis did we survive that? Magic. We seem all right. I don't know. It could be that we were just lucky, but I'm sure there must be more to it than that. You were protected by the power of Lady Mayneth. Who's there? Oh, hello, it's a magna. A machina. Are you... Vanea? Vanea? Does that mean you're... Mikol's daughter? I am glad you are safe. Lady Mayneth. Huh? Lady Mayneth? What do you speak of? That face was sent to destroy you. I really? am truly happy you're all right. You're lying. Gado would never try and hurt us. Sadly, his home's memories no longer remain. The current faces are nothing more than weapons designed to annihilate all life on Bionis. 
It can't be. Faces are created by directly integrating the brainstem and metabolic organs of Homs into Mekon. You. Memories and emotion are nothing but a hindrance to an effective weapon. However, the early faces were experimental. Many retained memories from their former lives. This prevented them from executing their missions effectively. More recent faces have had all memories of their previous lives completely erased. Is that because of me? No, it is not your fault. Munkar seems the more likely candidate. His attachment to us was too strong. You could say it caused his destruction. That sword one and all. You are correct. No, it's not true. Oh, my ghetto. Sharla? Explain it to me. I mean, why does Egil want to make us into Mekon? What's the reason for all this? Yes. In order to counter the Monado. I knew it. The Monado is ineffective against the Hyentia, the Homs, against all races of Bionis. Egil suffered a bitter defeat in the battle one year ago. After that, he theorized that he could counter the Monado by integrating organic life from Bionis. Of course. Initially, the Monado couldn't take a Homs life. It can now, though. It could not harm those who share the blood of Zanza. That was its sole weakness. But Zanza lifted that constraint. Those who share the blood of Zanza? Who is that giant? The progenitor of the Homs. Him? And once the friend of my brother, Egil, before they became sworn enemies. <sighs> it was Zanza who devastated Maconis. Zanza? What? So Zanza was the aggressor, according to Venea. Meanwhile... Well, so we can't go back to Sword Valley now. Wow! Look at that! Are they the Havras? They're the latest anti-Mekon weapons, designed by Lorathea and the Ministry of Research. What a glorious sight. The coming together of all the peoples of Bionis. Yes, sir. This is how it should always have been. Then perhaps father would not. Your Highness. If Dixon gets his own. We are fortunate that Dixon informed us of the enemy's new weapon. Our defenses are ready. Today, we start our campaign against Galahad Fortress. Just beyond the fortress lies the Imperial capital of Mekonis. This is a battle to determine not just our own fates, but the future of all life on Bionis. We fight for future prosperity and the glory and honor of all. Troops, advance! <laughs> And I feel like with how fast you're moving, you should have been there by now, but okay. Are you saying that Zanza is to blame for Makonis devastation? It's Zanza's sword that I'm using. Does this mean we're enemies? And if so, why are you... Shulk, calm down. Sorry. Wait, I... 20 questions? I will take you to the Makonis capital. Agniritha. Is that your plan? Lead us straight to the gates of our enemy? Deliver us into Egil's hands? It will be quicker to show you than to explain. Then you will understand the history of Maconis and the battle between the two titans. Up ahead is a lift that leads to the central factory within the chest of the Maconis. The capital, Agniritha, lies just beyond there. Ooh. Venea is a guest. Uh, I don't know where exactly this is. On the Makanis. It's kind of hard to tell. We can use these, uh, really fast conveyor belts. Well, actually, maybe we're kind of like around the pelvis, perhaps. 
like this would be like a joint between the well what for the actually no we were in the lake before this is probably like the joint between the uh, leg and pelvis second gamalt bulkhead Yes, here is the elevator. It looks like an orbital lift from one of the fancy sci-fi movies. Elevator, let's go up. Ooh. I didn't do the Collectopedia for... What is it? Not Central Factory, no. Conus Field. Juicy steak plant. Doesn't look good, but tastes nice. Looks like meat when you cut into it. That doesn't sound very appealing for a vegetable. Ace roll a pea. A pea so bitter it'll drain the color from your face. Energy aubergine. Bitter green aubergine that builds stamina. Recommended for men. What is an aubergine? I, I know it's an actual ve vegetable. I think it's, is it an eggplant or is it a cucumber? It's an eggplant, that's what it is. Purple egg-shaped fruit of a tropical old world plant, which is often eaten as a vegetable, also known as an eggplant. A dark purple color like the skin of an eggplant. Yeah, I think it's just an eggplant. That's what it is. It's just that aubergine is a word for eggplant. As many Americans know the fruit better as an eggplant. Anyways. Sweet pepper. Sweet fruit is often mistakenly thought of as a vegetable. I get the torso arms. Azure hollyhock. A beautiful flower also known as, this, as the sea blue stone. Even though it's not a rock, but okay. Topia crocus. Looks like a piece of barrel has come into bloom. It's glow and frost. We can agility up. Four. I think that's four. Scarlet crawler. Calipeter of delicate red whose fine hairs are sharp like needles. Shiny scarab. A cute shiny beetle. It's not really one to pick a fight with others. A water boatman. Okay. It's hard to pick up with the slip this slippery lad that protects it against foes. We get days up four. Ivy nest, a nest for small animals that's made out of ivy. A mossy panel, a metal sheet whose exposed areas are corroded by the elements. Of course the bronze wood. I think you need two of this. It's useless for building because its bark is made of bronze. You get first attack plus three. A retro diode, an archaic diode with red light that's always on. Modern blue geared, efficiently constructed gear wheel. It's beautiful. It's so beautiful, it's a shame to use it. Snow transistor. Transistor that causes visions of snow flares when you switch it on. We get lightning attack four. So we get the tweet tweet. Ricky was chirping when he named just a weird feathery thing like a chick. Flame frame. Charlotte named this cautiously. Peep inside to see a merry light. Fall defense four. Completing the area gets us the Taurus helm. Uh, these probably aren't all that great, though, to be honest. Yeah. So, new skill. Oh, reduces the depletion of party gauge. Reduces ether. Anyways. Time to move on to this big open area that has a giant, super fast spinning gear beneath us. Let's not fall. Port terminal! Worldly wise. It's for finding a certain amount of central gate. No. Finding a certain amount of landmarks, I believe. Here we are in the Mechonis Central Factory. It's in the chest of the Bionis. Mechonis, excuse me. We're not in the Bionis. Wow, it's got big giant pistons. 
and uh, Fanta. Orange Fanta. Orange Crush. I guess. This is the central factory within the chest of the Maconis. Can you see the ring up ahead? No. Now I At can. At the base of that ring is a transporter that leads to Agniratha. We must first head there. This place is full of autonomous security, Mekon. Tread carefully. I don't know what tread carefully means. Go to maintenance, whatever one. You go over there or something. There's a button here. It does nothing. Yeah, we won't be able to do anything with that for a while. Hmm, which way should we go? Oh yeah, that's right, there's a portal here. Oh. Cool. They've reused that, that portal thing like twice now. Not that there's an issue with that. Landing strip 2. It looks really pretty. So they used that same portal model in Xenoblade 3, except it's blue and red. It's dead. Or is it orange? I don't know. Oh. These uh, undulating pistons. So many moving pistons. Ooh, geez, you're moving fast. But of course, I'm moving faster. Leave your unique monster. Yes, smile, Florence. Let's fight. Probably gonna get attention that dude. Yep. Burn, burn. I should focus on the smaller dudes. Big smash flying attack. Where is the degenerate team? Oh, now it's time for you. You for your item. Now get frozen. Here is poison. Here's backstab. Here's this. You're helpless now. Here's freezing. And dead. Oh, I got a level up. Ooh, the Magna Cannon. I think that's an upgraded version of the Magna stuff. It's got a shield bullet. Wow! Did I get a new chest plate? A Grigus plate. Pretty sure that's old, though. Oh, the Magna Cannon is not an upgrade. I thought it was. Hmm. Hardly a problem. Shield bullets level 10, uh, tasty. A vision. It's the second angel engine X. Ooh, this is for colony six. We better take them to colony six. They might be, they must be eager to get them. That doesn't sound like Dumbin at all. Uh, which, which, which? Oh, I have enough for this now. Also, I should have traded for those Hawks Daylight Spurs with Box of Trocks. Oh, I'll do that off screen. Red Frontier. Ooh. Well, I went up the wrong path anyways, so. I'll probably end this recording. 
go trade for those spurs because I don't want to beat up those level 80 enemies. Ow. Yeah, that's what I'll do. I will trade for those spurs off screen. You can get them from Bozatrox because she's cool. It will be done quickly. This much I can promise.